Hello and welcome to the first episode of Frankie's Time Machine. Um, today, we'll be talking to a classic F1 team. Um, sorry, by the way, if my mic sounds a, a little bit worse than usual. Uh, I couldn't find the headphones, I had the good mic, so I'm having to use this one uh, instead. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to find it soon, so it should be alright. Uh, but let's get straight into it. Uh, but before we do, please... Take the second to subscribe, I'll give you a second. Go on, see if you can do it before I complete this sentence. Jensen Button won the 2009 World Championship with Braun GP. Did you do it before I ended the sentence? Let us know in the comments. And uh, let's get straight into it, because I'm not going to hold you back anymore. I know all these people say it, so, you know, you must be a bit tired of it. Anyway, so, Andrew Amoda. Uh, a few of you might know who I'm on about here. One of the worst F1 teams in F1 history. Uh, so in 1992, it was founded by the Italian shoe designer Andrea Sassetti. Uh, he bought the Coloni team, who actually failed to qualify in any race in 1991. Uh, he did a deal with Syntec for a car that had been designed in 1990. It's a two-year-old design car, which is like a team coming in and running a 2020 car. But obviously, it's a bit different. <laughs> Because the regulations were a bit different back then. But it was one of the worst cars on the grid because of this. Uh, so round one then. We'll go we'll, we'll go through each round they actually competed in. So round one was at South Africa. Uh, they weren't allowed to enter because they didn't pay the mandatory £100,000 uh, deposit or euro deposit for new teams. Because the SETI argued that it wasn't a new team. <coughs> and that he bought Coloni. <coughs> However... He didn't buy the team's championship entry, so technically it was a new team just with Colony's assets. And because he didn't uh, pay, he was, the team was not allowed to compete in round one. So then, round two, Sassetti just fired both his drivers after complaining of the team's lack of prep. Bit mental. I mean, there you go. So uh, yeah, there goes those two, those two drivers, just gone. But um, they then hired uh, Moreno, who actually went on to become the Stig. Uh, he actually managed to run the car for the first time competitively, uh, but the car failed to even make pre-qualifying. And then they uh, also hired Perry McCartney, uh, who even though he shared a surname with the Beatles member, wasn't the best, uh, wasn't much special. He, uh, he didn't even compete because he was denied the super licence, which, if you didn't know, is what all F1 drivers need to have to compete in F1. <laughs> Uh, basically, back then, it was kind of a driving test to see if the driver was safe and fast enough to be in F1. And it's, <coughs> like, pretty unheard of to have a driver denied of a super license. So, it's pretty mental if one of your drivers that you've literally fired someone for to be denied the super license. Um, so then, round, uh, round McCartney, round three, uh, McCartney finally did get a super license. Uh, and Baguetta... Bogaeta, one of the team's old drivers, actually approached the, uh, the team with a offer of 1 million euros in the sponsor money uh, if he drove for them in place of McCartney. Um, he wanted to, uh, Sassetti, of course, wanted to, uh, but the FIA uh, did not allow the team to make any more driver changes due to the fact that they'd already dropped both drivers and then brought new ones in. And this is where things go downhill for this team. So, basically, to put it short, <clears throat> Sassetti has focused the team's funds on Moreno and kind of neglected McCartney. <coughs> and it gets a lot, it gets pretty bad here. Okay, so in Monaco, McCartney didn't qualify. Moreno miraculously somehow managed to qualify for the race. He started the race in 26, uh, but he retired after 11 laps with engine failure. Here we go then, Canada. The team arrived without engines. I mean, he didn't pay Judd, their supplier, um, and so they didn't give him engines. Moreno literally borrowed an engine from Brabham, uh, but failed to be able to buy, and McCartney couldn't even get out on track. Um, now, at this point, McCartney's car was kind of just a spare for Moreno, and the Brit received extremely poor treatment from the team. <coughs> and at Silverstone, his home race, he was sent out on the wet in the dry. If you don't understand what that means, uh, there's a big difference between wet tyres and dry tyres. <laughs> and it's, like, stupid to put Edric Kyver out on wet tyres in the dry end. Well, they did. 
Um, in Hungary, the team literally only let him out track at pre-qualifying with 45 seconds before the end of the se- session. I mean, he couldn't even set a lap. Andy and Modo were warned to make more effort to run McCartney's car or they risk exclusion. But they kind of ignore this. And at Spa, uh, both cars were guaranteed to enter qualifying due to Brabham withdrawing from the um, from the weekend. The two were the slowest on track. Uh, Moreno was 13% slower than Pole, and McCartney, who suffered a huge crash in his session, was also 22% slower. Neither qualified. <laughs> then, Sassetti uh, was arrested due to forging auto part invoices, apparently. The team was then expelled from racing on the FIA on grounds of failure to operate a team in a manner compatible with the standards of the championship or in any way that brings the championship in a dispute. Well, if you watch to the end, uh, thank you for doing so. Um, please drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, we actually hit 69 subscribers today, and I was going to make a little joke about it. Um, but when I was meant to, we were at 78. Like, just like that. It was been about an hour. <coughs> so that's absolutely amazing, guys. So thank you for the support. We really do appreciate it. This is obviously a very new and very small channel. So uh, we'd love for it to grow. And with that one, guys, thank you for watching and have a nice day. I That has become a catchphrase now. So have a nice day.